One night, signalman Joe Baldwin was sleeping in the caboose of a train, only to be awakened by a sudden jerk. The caboose had detached itself from the rest of the train. The rest of the train moved on, not knowing Joe's caboose was stranded near Mako Station by Wilmington, North Carolina. Being stranded on the tracks was bad enough. What was worse was that Joe knew a passenger train was coming. Someone needed to warn the oncoming train about the caboose stuck on the tracks. So Joe stood on the back of the caboose waving his lantern. It was the only place high enough where the other train might see him. He knew he might die sitting up there, but if the oncoming train didn't at least slow down, everyone else on the train would die as well. The passenger train came on schedule. Joe waved his light and prayed. The conductor saw his light and tried to stop the train. Thankfully, Joe's actions allowed the train to slow down just enough to save the passengers' lives. Unfortunately, the momentum was too much. Joe's body was crushed as the engine slammed into the caboose, severing his head in the process. He died instantly. His head was never found. Soon after the accident, a mysterious light that looked like a single man's lantern was found hovering near the tracks by Mako Station. This strange light was dubbed the Mako Light. The Mako Light was witnessed by thousands of people for almost a hundred years. Locals say it was Joe still trying to keep the tracks safe. Either that or it was Joe still searching for his lost head. The light finally stopped in 1977 when the railroad tracks near Mako Station were removed. Some scientists think the Mako light was possibly cast by passing cars or maybe by homes onto the tracks. Others think geological activity under the tracks caused natural electric sparks to light up the area near the tracks. Either way, taking away the tracks seemed to stop the lights. And the locals? Well, they say Joe's finally satisfied that everyone is safe now the trains are gone. Oh, and he finally found his head!